Today we are unboxing the Woolino sleep sack that we absolutely love. It's made by Woolino. It's merino wool. It's their four season sleep bag. Um, Awesome stuff. You guys, these are amazing. We love these. Let's just open it and get started. Okay. So let me first show you how long this sleep sack is. I hope that the whole thing is in the camera so you can see it all. But these are really tall compared to every other sleep sack that we tried, which is amazing because they last for so long. It's actually for sizes two to 24 months. So really this should be the only sleep sack you need which it's a bit of an investment, but it is 100% worth it. The outside is 100% wool, or the inside is 100% wool, and the outside is 100% cotton, so it's really soft, it's really, I mean, it feels amazing to touch. It's not too bulky, but it has a good amount of weight to it, so you know that it's keeping them warm. Um, let's start with this little tag that comes on it. Do you wanna help, sweetie? I've got Greta here with me, and she wants to put it on. She's ready for a nap, so she sees it and she wants it. So it comes with this little card that will tell you kind of how warm it is in your room. Right now it's like right around 70 where we're at. And then on the back it tells you what to dress them in based on the temperature, which is really awesome. We live in Utah where it gets really cold in the winter and really warm in the summer. And this is the one sack we use all year. It doesn't matter how cold it is or how hot it is. This is what we're using. You ready to put it on, huh baby? Okay, should we show them how we put it on? Okay, Greta is ready to put this on. So we're gonna show you what we do. Um, when you look at the front, this side has an embroidered logo, which I don't know if this is on purpose, but I love it because in the night when it's dark and we're putting them to bed and they're not in their sleep sacks yet, it's one of the last things we do in their routine. Um, we try to keep the room pretty dark. I can feel the neck and find which side has the logo on it, and I know that it goes right here on her chest. So I can put this on her in the dark without ever having to look, which is super easy. I always leave this side snapped because it doesn't have the zipper. This side has the zipper. You're ready, you want this on. So I always leave this side snapped, and what I do is I just feed it through her arm, kind of lay it over her. I come around to the back and I snap this side but she loves the snaps, so she always wants help with the snaps. You see a snap right there, huh? And then I just lift her up and kind of let it fall behind her back. Tuck her feet in. It does unzip all the way. I hope this is on. All the way to this side. So you could open it all the way up. I only do that if I'm changing a diaper. I use it, I leave it mostly zipped. It also has a double zipper, so you can change a diaper in the night without having to take her all the way out. Um, Put her legs in, just make sure it's kind of covering her, and then I just zip it all the way up. And then under the armpits, there are two little snaps. <laughs> yeah, she's so ready for her nap. She knows that this means it's nap time, and when she's tired, she'll actually go get it out of her bed and bring it to me, huh? So there's little snaps under the armpits. This helps for when babies are smaller. They're pretty small for their age still. So we, we like to use these. It keeps it a little bit more snug, and then it doesn't have this big open armhole. So we snap that up. It keeps it snug on her pits. And then she just snuggles right in this, huh? You ready to go lay down? Okay. Okay. While well, Greta's taking a nap, I'll finish showing you with our other sleep sack. We have these ones as well. This is the earth color. The orange one is the rust color. It has this, which is not a pocket. It goes actually all the way through. So you can use it with a stroller and still keep them buckled securely in their stroller. And just put the strap through there. The quality is really amazing. These are still in great condition and we use these every single night. We've used them for, geez, I don't know, months. I've maybe washed these ones four times. And two of those times were because one of the babies actually spit up quite a bit on one, so I wanted to get the milk out. But um, it's merino wool, and so it doesn't get smelly or stinky or sweaty, so you really don't have to wash these nearly as frequently as you do other sleep sacks. 
We have two per baby so that we can be washing one set and the babies can wear the other. Um, you can tumble dry these. I, on no heat, I actually just lay them out to dry. Um, the wash instructions say, close zipper, use gentle wool cycle on low, so 100 degrees Fahrenheit or about 40 Celsius. And then it says use a wool detergent, uh, which they do sell on Wolino's website. The detergent that we use for all our baby clothes, for all of our clothes actually, our whole family uses the same detergent, is a uh, wool safe detergent anyways. So we don't use any special detergents other than what we already use. And then I just wash them on the gentle wool cycle and I lay them out to dry. So that having, having two per baby is really helpful so that you have time. You don't have to try and hurry and finish all of the load of wash in one day and get it to dry because it does take a little bit longer to dry since you can't dry it with heat.